Hello everyone, welcome back to Setting Things Down Explained. Let's get right into the first video. Last week, a very mysterious live stream appeared on his channel. It was only around a couple minutes long, so not many people got to see it. I was one of the very fortunate people who got to see it. It opens up a still shot of his bedroom, with not much happening. The more the video progresses, the more the audio starts to get distorted. Some sort of demonic screeching or something starts to play, and then it ends and cuts abruptly. It's followed by a song from the game called Earthbound. In the video, the window is open, meaning that somehow he escaped or was taken out. The name of the video is Take Me Back. After a brief hiatus, he uploaded another video. It was called How to Set Down a Spoon. Notice how instead of setting down a spoon, it's called How to Set Down a Spoon. He's changed the style of content he's been creating. The video is filmed like an Allen tutorial video. It's a tutorial that teaches us how to put down a spoon. At the very end, he puts the thumbs up and tells us to subscribe. But the thumbnail says, not clickbait. By saying this, he wants to make the impression that the video is what it seems to be. In his other videos, they aren't what they seem to be. They're, they're different. But now that he's saying that it's not clickbait, he wants us to know that the video is what it seems. Nothing else about it. This seems an awful lot like the behavior of someone we know, him. Could this be him making the videos, or is it really just the main character? We don't know. There's also a comment that says, Hello everyone, I would like to welcome you to a brand new series on this channel where I, STD, show you how I set things down. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I love making videos for you all. The next video is filmed in the exact same tutorial manner, except this time there's something in the description. Hope you guys are enjoying the new series as much as me. I love making tutorials for you all. This, like the comment in the last video, makes it suggest that he likes what he's doing, even though he might not. Now let's look at some comments. Fried Rice said, I checked the other videos, but the clock seems to be stuck at 7.37 and 27 seconds. This means that the clock's been set at a certain time in every single video. Apparently, it's a Bible verse. Also, it might have something to do with the 7.30 in the video description from setting down a small log. The Bible verse is, But the man who has settled the manner in his own mind, who is under no compulsion but has control over his own will, and who has made up his mind not to marry the virgin, this man also does the right thing. From Corinthians or something. One key line is, In his own mind, who is under no compulsion but has control over his own will. This is a theme that this series brings up a lot control. The main character most times does not have control over what he makes on the channel. This is very, very important. To add to the idea that this isn't all what it seems, Jade Steele commented, I'm not buying it. <laughs> Me either. In the next video's description, he writes, please everyone, feel free to share with your friends if you found the tutorial helpful. This seems like he's pleading us to do it. He's trying to persuade us to share the video. He wants more views. In How to Sit Down an Orange Cone, he puts down the orange cone while gasping and wheezing, as if he was out of breath. This is one of the side effects of the E88 drug he was taking the entire series. This adds to the theory that he's been, he's been locked in the room still, but every time he makes a new video, a tutorial, he gets rewarded with more pills. Similar to how Alan's tutorial makes more tutorials and is rewarded with money. Perhaps this is the same captor. If you compare this channel to Alan's tutorial, there was a long time when Alan tried to escape, but after being given money, he stayed and made his videos. This may be the same thing happening to STD. Notice how he's in Kothik anymore. Perhaps this captor gave him more pills if he made more How to Set Down videos. You can see in How to Set Down an Orange Cone, there's a pill bottle on top of laundry baskets, which appears to be full. The second theory is that the STD that's making these videos isn't the STD that we know. That would explain everything that would happen in the live stream. Perhaps the demonic screeching we hear is him realizing that STD had escaped, so he took over. Fried Rice says that also explains why fake STD doesn't repost the live stream. But we still have no clue why him is making tutorial videos like Alan's tutorial and what happened to the real STD. That's all stuff that we'd have to find out in the future, so thanks guys 
And uh, the next STD explain video, I'll be explaining the Tolip files. If you know, if you don't know what those are, it's a Imgur user who's been posting like secret message slash like encrypted like kind of weird pictures, and they have to do with this with setting things down. So yeah, I'll be covering those in the next video. So I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.